What's up, YouTubers? Welcome to the Stud Radio channel. And I said I would do a part two to my gameplay and review of Dragon Age Inquisition, where I introduced you guys to Orle, um, a part of the Theta's world that we did not get to see in the first two Dragon Age core games. So, from the world map, I am headed to um, Skyhold, which is pretty much um, the Inquisitor's central location or central operations uh, location. My fort or castle, which I run. <laughs> I am the ruler of. And this game usually doesn't take that, that long between loading screens on the PS4, I guess because I'm so far into the game. About 75 plus hours in on this particular profile. But as you can see, it's my character is a female elf rogue. I prefer the rogue characters because they can unlock doors and rogues are not very strong. Hey, here's Varric. Rogues are not very strong as far as constitution is concerned. Their defenses aren't very strong, so I don't like to really have an extra one of them as my companions uh, when I'm expecting really big fights. So, pretty much most of what you'll do in this game will happen at a war table. You'll meet with your council, your council and decide uh, what the Inquisis Inquisitors or the Inquisition's next moves are going to be uh, in your war. So, one place I have not been is here to this part of Orle. We're going to open up Empress this region. We're going to open up this part the of the world is, and meet the Empress. We know how. I have our way in. The real question is, where is our enemy hiding? At the urging of Grand Duchess Florian, the Empress is holding a ball. Absolutely everyone will be there. During the festivities, Celine will be meeting for peace talks with the usurper Duke Gaspard and Ambassador Briala. The assassin must be hiding within one of these factions. We shouldn't waste any time. Let's go to the Winter Palace. So off we go. Let's check out the Winter Palace in Orle. And let's bring our fancier bunch. How about uh, Dorian? Who else? Vivienne. She is from Orle. And let's see who else has some class. We don't have a lot of options, do we? Ah, screw it. Cassandra. This is where all the fancy pants are in Thetis. A bunch of punks. So let's go see what's going on here. I just pretty much want to show you guys what this is all about. Really quick, and then I'm going to move on with my gameplay. And if you don't have the game, inspire you guys to go out and get it. So you can enjoy it as I have. It's with these slow loads. I've never seen this before. This is weird. It's usually like five second loading screens on this sucker. This is ridiculous. The political situation in Hanamshirad right, hangs that's a new attire. The Empress Beautiful game. Awesome. The Grand Duke is only too happy to have us at the ball as his guests. So our invitation comes from him. Whether we act as his allies or upset the balance of power, he gains an opportunity. If not a clear advantage. Welcome to Orle. It is a great pleasure to meet you, Inquisitor Lavellen. The rumors coming out of the Western approach say you battled an army of demons. Imagine what the Inquisition could accomplish with the full support of the rightful Emperor of Orle. I can see many benefits to such an alliance. Keep the image firmly in mind. We may see it materialize by the end of the evening. I am not a man who forgets his friends. What a bunch of weirdos. You help me, I'll help you. My lady, are you prepared to shock the court by walking into the Grand Ball? 
They will be telling stories How are those this masks? Stay on their the face. Whatever. It's a pleasure to meet you, Duke Gaspard. I look forward to ending this civil war. As do I, my friend. The Empire needs stability and security now more than ever. If you have the safety of the Orlesian people at heart, Inquisitor, perhaps you will look into something for me. This elven woman, Briara, I suspect that she intends to disrupt the negotiations. My people have found these ambassadors all over the fortifications. Sabotage seems the least of their crimes. That sounds like something I should look into. Be as discreet as possible. I detest the game, but if we do not play it well, our enemies will make us look like villains. We're keeping the court waiting, Inquisitor. Shall we? So I get to meet these jerks. Isn't that Fancy little place, though. An elf the palace of the Empress. This is huh? idea of a joke. Yeah, 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 yeah. So I automatically lose like 10 influence points or something because I'm an elf and no one likes elves. <sighs> I got a lot of work ahead of me to get these people to like be impressed or like me or whatever. This game is crazy. I love it. You there. So you start by running around this anyone? courtyard trying to gain favor from nobles. Before you can get into the ball. I cannot go into the ball without it. That sounds That's really serious. Whatever. If the Comtesse finds out, make her have mercy. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. So, like, for example, you can find this chick's, like, ring or whatever. Take it to her. Make her. What am I going to do if I cannot find my ring? And gain some favor. See? Court approval. Plus five. Yay. The They're for? starting to like me now. Hee <laughs> hee. Whatever. So anyway. For my last video, when I was showing you guys my review and doing a quick gameplay of like traveling the map. This is an example of what I mean by the game is free roam but not quite open world. I've opened up this part of the region of Orlay. Um, everything we do uh, within this mission is going to take place in or around this palace. So it's not like... It's not like I can just run out of the gates and just go wherever. This is the area which this mission here will take place. Probably, I don't know, you'll spend about 30 minutes to an hour completing the mission here. Which is saving the Empress's ass. So this is an example. Welcome to Orlay. This is what Orlay is all about. It's some kind of like, I don't know, half-ass like Paris wannabe type place, but a very cool concept. All right, guys. Later.